Hi, this is Anil from Learning Lad Education and welcome to the What's the Output video series on C programming language. Here we're going to give you a C program and we're going to ask you guys to guess the output of the program and then you know we're going to explain the output. So all you need to do is pause this movie and take a look at the source code which is here in the editor and then come up with the output of this program. Once you have an answer just play the movie, I'm going to explain the output. Alright, now I believe that you guys have an answer for this program. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do build and run. So it's going to be build and run. And the answer for this program is going to be what's up? Welcome to learning lad. So now why the heck we're going to get what's up? Welcome to learning lad. So here the preprocessor expressions are not the same as the ordinary expressions. If a macro is not known to the preprocessor, then the preprocessor treats it to be equal to zero. Uh, in this program, you guys can see here, we haven't defined the macro learning lad. And here, when we use it with the if preprocessor directive, it's going to treat this learning lad as zero, zero equal to zero. So the condition satisfies and that's why this printf statement will be included. And that's why you know we're gonna get the output what's up and welcome to learning lad so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna define the uh, learning lad macro and i'm gonna use the has defined preprocessor directive and it's gonna be learning lad and i'm gonna set to a value of one all right now i'm gonna build and run now you guys can see we're gonna get only welcome to learning lad because i have defined this learning lad macro and i have set a value of one in it and that's why you know this if is gonna fail and the printf statement which is inside this if will not be included and here you can initialize this macro learning lad with any values you know if you want you guys can initialize it with zero also if i initialize it with zero and build and run it you know the program uh, runs and it says what's up and welcome to the learning lad that's because you know learning lad is going to contain zero zero equal to zero condition satisfies and this printf will be included and the thing to remember in this tutorial is if you don't define a preprocessor macro this preprocessor is going to treat it as zero and uh, that's it guys thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel check out my website learninglad.com for more tutorials and i'll see you in the next tutorial